Hey, what is up guys, it's the iCracker here. So today I just wanted to show you um, a new jailbreak that's come out called the Saigon Jailbreak and it's a 10.2.1 jailbreak uh, by the developer Abraham Massery. Uh, sorry that's if I pronounced it wrong. Um, and it supports the iPod Touch 6th generation 10.2.1, iPhone SE 10.2.1 iPhone 6, 6 Plus, 10.2.1 iPhone 6S, 6S Plus, 10.2.1 iPad Mini 4, 10.2.1 iPad Air, 10.2.1 and iPhone 6S, 10.3.1 although it's not uh, tested yet uh, and same goes for iPad Mini 4 now, uh, if you do have one of these devices on 10.2.1 you know if you got lucky and did not update to 10.3 or iOS 11 then I, I, today I'm going to show you how you can download Saigon without a computer so what you do first you're going to go to the link in the description and you, on your uh, device on 10.2.1 and you're going to press uh, you're going to come to this page and you can press install and then this is going to pop up saying it wants to install the Saigon Jailbreak app all you have to do is press yes go back to your home screen and then you'll see it there just um, downloading so of course once it's installed uh, if you try to open it it'll ask you to trust the developer through settings and what you do for that you go to settings general and you go all the way down and press profiles and device management you tap that and then uh, you're going to press uh, whatever um, profile it was and in this case it's Changsha and what you're going to do is press trust and then trust again once it's trusted you're going to go back to your home screen open the app and for me this is on uh, an iPhone uh, 5s on 10.3.2 um, so in my case it won't work because it's not supported so of course if you are if you do have a device on 10.2 for one uh, I'd recommend that you do uh, jailbreak your device instead of up updating it to iOS 11 which uh, for the most part looks like it won't be uh, getting a jailbreak anytime soon um, compared to iOS 10 this time last year which had the jailbreak in development and that were, turned out to be Yalu uh, which is in, still in use today by uh, iOS 10.2 users including myself on iOS 10.1.1 on an iPhone 6 and of course all the other 64-bit devices apart from the iPhone 7 and 7 Plus of course once you open the app obviously it will uh, show this UI and uh, there's going to be a jailbreak button in the middle for me it says device not supported but instead of saying that for you uh, if you're on 10.2.1 it'll say jailbreak all you have to do is press jailbreak you go back to your home screen or, or I mean you press jailbreak and then uh, once you just leave it and then it should restart the springboard and once it restarts the springboard uh, you're going to unlock your phone and then it should be uh, there should be a Cydia icon on your home screen and what you're going to do from there is go to changes and refresh the sources if it's already doing that then that's alright you don't have to do anything just wait till it's done so Cydia uh, gets all its packages and whatnot. Uh, from its default repos like the um, big bus repo and etc however uh, this jailbreak is still in beta by the way uh, as as it's only on beta 2 it's not quite finished yet but it is a working jailbreak however I am not sure if any tweaks do work for it of course if they do I'll let you know I know I haven't uploaded a video in some time uh, it's because I've had a lot of like uh, work to do and just all these assignments and stuff like that. Uh, I just haven't had the time to make a YouTube video. Uh, but now I'm on my uh, one week break, like holiday. So I am able to make a YouTube video like the one that you're watching now. 
So as I was saying, uh, most tweaks will not support iOS 10.2.1 right away. Uh, I'd say you leave it jailbroken and just wait a little bit of time uh, till the tweaks get updated. And once they get updated, then you can uh, just like go mad in customizing your device for the way you want. Um, and yeah, I mean, this is a, a good start on getting iOS 10 fully jailbroken on all versions. Um, as you know, iOS 9 has already been jailbroken on all versions just recently by the jailbreak app Phoenix uh, which I do have on this device even though it's on 10.3.2 so if you open it uh, it's this jailbreak the Phoenix jailbreak and um, of course it says your iPhone yeah it yeah because it's not supported so well, that about brings it to the end of this video uh, so if you enjoyed the video please like uh, and uh, also if you're new to the channel please subscribe as it really does help me out and uh, we are getting close to a thousand uh, so I am still awaiting that day <laughs> but um, we are going to reach a thousand pretty soon so uh, it will help if you could subscribe as of uh, as I've just started getting back into YouTube, uh, seeing as I made this channel back in 2011, I never gave so much thought about it, but seeing as uh, how many views my videos were getting, you know, I decided to actually, you know, actually, you know, put some work into the channel and uh, see what I can do. So, I mean, we are, uh, as the time of uh, this recording, I'm about 660 uh, subscribers, which is, yeah, not a lot, but uh, from the support and um, that, you know, people are subscribing and, you know, uh, it does mean a lot to me and uh, it does, now it does encourage me to make more and new uh, videos for you guys. Um, so, yeah, if you could subscribe, that would be just that would make my day and uh, please share uh, the video as well with your friends on 10.2.1 or anyone you know who's on 10.2.1 but doesn't have a computer to jailbreak uh, this will be really really helpful for them and uh, yeah so see you guys in the next one